I lived on one of the most overpowered islands while playing one of the most popular Rust servers. It had an unlimited food source with rivers, its own recycler at Lighthouse, and it was right next to Oil Rig. The only issue is, we weren't the only ones who wanted to live on it. We had wars with our neighbors for control over the island, and let's just say, me and my duo were a little outnumbered. But we weren't scared of a challenge. Will we be able to come out on top? Well, we're not there just yet. This story starts with me in a boat farming up the ocean. But quickly before we get over to there, I just wanted to give a special little thank you for 5,000 subscribers, boys. I've always wanted to make YouTube videos since I was super young, and about two months ago, I started up my grind. We've come a long way in such a short amount of time, and I don't plan to stop anytime soon. If you guys want to talk to me more personally or know my Rust settings, you guys can join my Discord at the link at the top of the description. You don't gotta if you don't wanna, but let's get back to the video. We're full. Let's get over to Lighthouse. And with just that run, we nearly had enough scrap to get a tier 2. And while I was doing that, my teammates secured the first gun for the wipe. Something in L rolled up. You know, it might not be the best gun to have, but we're almost at a tier two workbench. And since I have pretty much every BP, we'll be having guns real soon. But before we could think about any workbenches, we need to get to our base spot. For our base spot, we were planning to live on one of the most overpowered islands on the server. It had an unlimited food source with all the rivers, its own recycler at Lighthouse. Just across the water, there was a fishing village and a few grids out was oil rig. This base spot was almost too good to be true. The only issue with this spot is we're a little late to wipe so there's already some people living on it and there's only one way to find out how many people are actually living on this island and that's to go out and explore it there's a knife you're running down through this base hey that wolf heady guy's on his roof body shot what? wait how'd he get in jump right down to his door he's down in there he's what, what? <laughs> Oh, run, 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 run. You try and get a peek on him. I need to know where he's going. Oh no, he's full metal. Oh, gotta run. How many? There's two. Don't even. They're both full metal. It's not even worth it. And they live right there. After doing just a quick little walk around our island, we found two active bases. The base with the two full metal kits living in it, and then the base with the wolf head he got. And seeing that the guys had full metal AK kits, it was safe to assume that they could have some explosives too. And we didn't want to get pushed off this island, so we went to work on our base. Get out of my way, bitch. Now that the base is somewhat upgraded, we could go around and start messing with people on our island again. But when we went by the base that had the full metal guys living out of it, we noticed that their base was decaying. And for some reason, these guys didn't want to go farm their own upkeep, so they offered us guns for stone, and you know, we couldn't resist that deal. And they made a pretty big mistake without even realizing it. Appreciate it. Now you guys might not have even noticed the mistake they made, but they showed us directly where their tier 3 was. And with their tier 3 being right there, it was pretty safe to assume that their loot was pretty close by. And that means we knew the cheapest way to all their loot, and it was only a few doors to get to it. But in order to raid them, we'd need a lot more than just a few guns. So we need to get on our grind. And in order to start that grind, we need to get some key cards going. So I went on over to Lighthouse to get a green card. Hey, what you doing up there? Hey, we're all friendly up here, man. We're all friendly role players up here, man. Friendly role players? I love friendly role players. Yeah. Yes. Slowball fight! Oh! Bruh. Look at this dude. 
All right, there still should be one more. Oh my god, he's loaded. Oh, that reminds me. We gotta thank the sponsor of today's video. Rust Class has just released slots to their site. You can deposit using your extra Rust, Dota, CSGO skins, or even crypto and card. They're also the only site to have direct PayPal or crypto cash out. If you want to support me when gambling, you can click the link at the top of the description or use code JTELUS to unlock rakeback and daily cases. Rust Class gives away $25,000 weekly in on-site reigns that are very easily claimable in chat. So again, if you guys want to support me, link at the top of the description or code JTELUS. Be safe, boys. You know after not missing any shots and killing that guy, we ended up securing a green card, which means we can go get a blue at Harbor. All right, well, now it's time to try to find a fuse. Oh, there's guys here. What? Kid, 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 kid. Weird, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he was. I, want to I just hit him twice. He's, he's Wolf Eddie. On me, dead. Yeah. Probably more. Now killing him there made this harbor run a lot more dangerous. Cause we couldn't leave until we found a fuse to get a blue card. And luckily, just as we were about to give up, Bubba killed this guy. Unless this guy's a fuse. Black Saber. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I don't know if you guys could tell, but we were a little excited to find a fuse. And now with that fuse, it puts us one step closer to getting a red card. But before we even had the chance to use our blue card, we got a little distracted by something. Oil's up. Should we just go? We can. Now we may not have all the cards, but Smoil is being ran instantly every single time it goes up. So I figured that if we went over there, someone else would be coming with cards. So we set off to Oil Rip. Dude, what? How did they manage to beat us on? They must have minied in or something. Maybe. Uh, they just go straight off or what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So fucking Double one dead. I, I whiff. He's one hit. Oh, oh my god. Low. Uh, we both just... We just got rolled? I'm dead across here. Alright, take two. This time, we're not messing up. They're holding hard. Yeah. I hit him three times. He's healing. There's two, there's two. One put it. He jumped down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, co he's coming to peek down. Woo, woo, woo. Triple daughter. Oh my god, he's loaded. Dude, I'm, I'm so loaded. Yeah, you leave, you leave. But before I could even have an opportunity to try to leave, I seen something flying in the air. Mini, 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 mini. Coming right in. I don't see it. Oh, I see it. Twice. Got him. There's two. There's two. Ah, no, dip, dip. no, 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 he's no. He's not no. coming in. He's, he's leaving. He's leaving. Alright, alright, if you say so. So we filled up the rib, and then I went home to depot the loot. But Bubba, he stayed back at oil to hold it down for us. But unfortunately, a mini ended up landing up top while he was down at the bottom. But Bubba, he wasn't going to let them take this oil without a fight. And while Bubba was securing down that oil rig, I had some trouble back at the base. Oh fuck. I'm getting tommy from outside of our base. Oh, there's a lot of them. 
There's three guys out front of our base. He died? No, no, no. No shot, they fell out of the rib. Jesus, all right, I, I, I killed all the kids out front of our base. Can you come pick me up a mini? I don't see anyone. Mini's coming back right now. I can see it. Oh my god, I just got fucked up out of the air. They landed. Holy fuck. Killed one? You killed the other. Oh wait, no you didn't. I'm down. Nice. I'm down right in between these two little silver things. After getting picked up by Bubba, I realized something pretty crazy about this oil rig. The red room hasn't even been started yet, so this fight hasn't even begun. Dude, what the fuck? Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm pinched in between a bunch of them. Oh, grenade launcher. Big. Oh, oh, there's a balti on cargo. Should we just send it on with the mini? Fuck it, dude. Fuck you, lad. Oh you just my got God. headshot. <laughs> I didn't jump out in time. Well, you know, we couldn't keep two minis in a two by two anyways. We got a rib coming. One under. They're coming. They're coming from re a cargo. No shot. They must think there's no one on here. Dead. He doesn't even say he died. Bro, so it's fucking full. The ribs full. Oh my god, those armored doors are so Oh, dead. that is tough. I mean, like, I was, like, born almost. Like, a couple years Eww. after I was born. Oh, that's okay. Uh, launch it for the raid. Just take the 8x for your bolty. And with that, we finally secured the crate, and oil rig was done with. At least we thought it was. Bolt coming in. Yeah, light as motherfucker. AK. Really? Since we were so loaded, we decided to just go home and depot all the loot. But not long after we got home, we heard something outside. That's all we need. Art? Huh? How the hell did you hear that? Headshot body, body. Dead. Maybe. Oh, headshot him again. What the fuck? I'm swimming out. Three little AK. Auto turret this is his name. That's them. That's them. That is them. Now we have a little bit of trouble because they now know that this 2x2 has all that loot we got from oil. So that means we got to start upgrading this base as fast as possible. And to do that, we grabbed up some comps, made our way over to Outpost, recycled them all up, and then traded all that scrap for some metal frags. And we were going to upgrade this base straight to sheet metal. All right. And... Done. Well, at least down for now. We need some more metal frags. So me and my duo really had no motivation to go out and farm. So we had a different plan to get resources. We'd keep running oil rig, and every time we get comps, we'd just recycle them and use all the scrap to buy more metal. Sounded like a perfect plan. But in order to start that plan, we need to go get another red card. Open, 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 open. You want me to run? Are you getting shot? Yeah, I am. Yeah. Oh my god. Just fly away. Fly away. I'm gonna die. Fly. Back to crash. Oh, fuck, man. That is fucked. You want to know the worst part? It's already ran. Oh, 
fucking hell, that guy scared the shit out of me. Oh, oh. No shot, these weirdos are roaming with a grenade launcher. Oh my god. There's a few of them. Yeah, I guess you just fight a lot. I hear someone on my body right now. gonna die. Yeah, now there's fucking four of them. That's, yeah, that was unwinnable. Well, since getting the red card didn't quite work, let's try a strat where we wouldn't even need cards. Let's go rub oil rig. Alright, alright, I'm up in this spot. Alright, this is so winnable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're SAR? They're fucking Tommy and SAR, bro. I don't have many meds. Yeah, I can jump and jump. Uh, but you know, I want to jump down here. You're holding ladder, right? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna watch and see if they rush down. I'm dead. I'm dead, right? They push up here. So like, down. I, I killed, killed one. They don't know where I am. Did you kill the downed one? Killed two. Killed the down one. All of them dead. Bro, I think we're getting raided. Bro, I think we're getting raided. Yeah, we are. We were getting raided, bro. I Shit. killed the guy raiding us. I'm um, F1ing. No, 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 no. no, no, no I already no, did. No. I already did. Now, unfortunately, when I heard Bubba say we were getting raided, I just wanted to F1 kill to help, but I didn't realize they didn't even start booming yet. So now we gotta try to get back onto oil. But, uh, it's a little easier said than done. Bro, I could kill him from here, man. I could kill him. Do I try? Uh, give me flippers. Oh, I'm tripping. Well, getting back onto oil didn't quite go to plan, but it was probably for the best because we end up meeting another group that lives on the island. And let's just say it wasn't a very friendly interaction. Snowballing our roof. What the fuck? What the fuck's wrong with it? I'm dead. Oh, I stood up. Heal up and get you, Tommy. I don't have heals. Oh, they're building up, they're building up. That's fine, there's nothing on the roof. Yeah, there's... It's a full metal. They're all looking at the door, crouched. What the hell did we do? Open up the door, boy! Fuck you, n- I am the ground man for leader of the clan. Stay and I'll leave. Right now, I ain't saying nothing. I guess not the friendliest was a bit of an understatement. They were some of the most toxic people I've ever met playing the game. And if you guys were curious why they were so upset, well, it's because the guy that Bubba killed with the boom on him was one of them. And they lived right in this base on the river. And with their base being that close to ours, we really needed to start upgrading. So we set off on a farm run. While I was farming up wood, Bubba was farming up some nodes around the island, but then he got sniped by an L9 to the head, and we couldn't just let that roof camper slide, so we had to go back over there and check it out. Oh, he got AK. Can you peek him so he crashes? Nice, I'm dead. I got an adder bag, I'll be there in like a second. Oh, motherfucker. L92. Thank you. Let's go. I knew he had that L9 on him. What can I say, man? Stay off your fucking roof. He gave us a free AK and a free L9. And now, we need to continue getting some farm. The only issue is, this island's getting quite dry. So we wanted to go back to our old plan. And that plan was to go to oil rig. They're all naked. They're probably going back to rig it. Going back to rig it. Okay. I'm just died. Oh, metal.
I don't know where the AK went. Oh, oh my god, your name completely was off, bro. Fuck. Fight, we're getting ready. Oh, god damn it. Alright, I'll be spawning in in two seconds. Oh, fuck. Oh, my god, I should have tripled time. Now they didn't bring over nearly enough boom to get into our base, so they just came over to mess with us. So we thought we'd return the favor. Well, time to see if they like getting their door blown off too. Lightus. Dude, what the hell is this? It's a fucking maze. Kill Tommy. The high ping failed me and I got two invalids, but it's all right because it didn't really matter. We just went there to piss them off. And you know, I'd say we accomplished our job. And while we were doing that, we got a little layout of their base. It was a, it was a little scary looking on the inside, but you know, you know we're, we're always up for a challenge. Now right. I needed uh, to go out and get I some food back. and I figured that we'd be safe for now because they just came over and ran out of boom, but I couldn't have been more wrong. Well, unfortunately, that's it for our base. They won, and they successfully pushed us off the island. At least that's what they thought they did. Bubba and I aren't ones to give up so easily. So we started back from zero with nothing but one goal in mind. Revenge. And I'll sum up how we got back on our feet. So we start off by coming back the next day. We check out their base just to make sure they're still on the server. And yeah, they uh, they HQM'd a bit. But while we were on the island, we also noticed a little something else. You guys remember these Full Metal AK kids? Well, their laziness helped us out again because they let their they furnace base decay, decay and their main base was soon to decay too. And getting That's their loot would be the perfect jump start we need to raid these guys. So they're we worked on getting into their base. Oh my god. As we were transferring out some of the loot that we got to, Bubba accidentally set off the shotgun trap, and it ended up giving some unwanted attention to us. And Wait, some people came to check it out. Up. He's on her. Yeah. I killed one. Bully dead. I know he's running. You can kill him. In the back. Running out there. Oh my god, dude. Uh, what the fuck? Now at this point, we pretty much eco raided into everything we possibly could. The rest of the base was at too high of an HP, so it would take way too long. So we'd have to wait out the base a little bit or get a little bit of explosives. Good thing someone just took heli nearby. We got this. You got any uh, more bullets? I fucking believe. Ah, uh, no. Who can left? Kill him. Nice. 
Jasper? I think I'm pretty sure he should be dead. C4 rockets. Walled. Well, with stealing that heli, we didn't have the eco rate anymore. We could boom right in. And it shouldn't be much. And we were hoping that their base would have a little bit of profit for us. Boxy guns. Oh my god. Look at the top right one. That's right. Yeah, Watch out. Can't see. Oh my god! Look at these bots! What the fuck, JT? Oh my god. It didn't give us the boom profit that we wanted, but it gave us a whole lot of profit and resources. But that didn't really matter to us. What we really needed was boom. And we seen that cargo was out, so we figured we'd give it a shot. I can get on. Come on. Oh, can't get on, dude. Yeah, high pings wonk. Come on. Might have been solo on here. And I was right. He was solo on here. And the rest of this cargo is pretty uncontested. So I'll show you guys what was in the crates. The crates were pretty bad considering all we needed was boom. At least, the lock crates were. With getting that C4, now we have two C4 and some Explo ammo. And we figured it was about time for us to go check out our neighbor's base. Bro. Bro! Oh, I thought they were fucking stone. I was about to freak out. Wait, that stone! Can we get under that? Now these guys messed up pretty big time. They forgot to upgrade that foundation, so it made their base a whole lot weaker than it should be. And it left us with the perfect amount of boom right, to get inside. this is gonna be sketchy. We better hope we get into somewhere. An upgrade hunter. Just hit it. Dude, what the hell is this? Like garage door? Oh my god. Look in there. Oh. Oh. Uh. We're in tier three. Oh, oh, and look at who it is. 